Okay, and welcome back to Titanic Adventure Out of Time. So, last time we managed to get into the wireless room and, well, borrow Zidal's telegram. Um, and which we have right here. So now, we should probably decode that. Actually, I'll keep that out. I'll need that, I'll just grab the key. Actually, I need the key. Let's have a look see. Okay, grab the telegram. Like I said, we'll grab the telegram. Put that there. Okay. Uh, eight, seven, five, four. So what we're doing here, we're gonna. So we just set the key to 8754, which is what that says here. We're going to flip this to decode. We need to do it again. 8, 7, 5, 4. And um, let's start decoding. So it's, can I use the keyboard? A, N, H, U, S, P, P, A, I, X, W, B, F. X, Y, AM. Alright, let's decode on that. Valid, please try again. Let's try without this. Try without the space, shall we? Shoot four. SB will deliver painting after pickup. We'll confirm. Zidal. Okay. So he's hidden the Rubaiyat in boiler room three on the fourth coal shoot. Which means we need to get the hell into that boiler room. SB. Hmm. SB. Painting would be in the cargo hold as well. Well, let's let's try and get into that boiler room. So we need to get to the aft section of the ship. I'm guessing is yes, the aft ground staircase. Okay, let's. Daisy Cashmore, surely you remember. Not really. You're a naughty thing. Don't think I didn't know you'd snuck on at Cherbourg. Smethels told me all about it. The old boy's always dripping with news. I heard about Lord and Lady Lambeth. <laughs> Ruined utterly. Scarcely enough left for appearances, I'm told. Ruined. I always liked Georgia. Married Charles for his name and his fortune, sensible girl. But she's made her nest. Now she must live in it. Well... Tell me more. What do we think? Gorgeous, isn't it? Everyone's raving, gushing. The Titanic couldn't be more fabulous. And the sailing couldn't have been more convenient. Everyone's here. The Astors, the George Wideners, the Countess of Roth, such a wonderful girl. The Strausses, I saw them on D-Deck tonight. The Ryersons, the Henry Harpers. I could just go on and on. And the ship's so very advanced. I was just saying to my dear friends, the Carters, they're bringing back a motor car, do you believe, in the cargo hold. Bill Carter checks it daily. Really, every day, he keeps the keys with the purser. And of course, they let them. The Carters are fantastically rich. Lucille doesn't understand the attraction at all. With men and machines, I tell her, we girls play second fiddle. Well, my dear, I have a little favor. A little favor. Tiny, tiny one. 
Why not? With pleasure. Tonight at dinner, a man I don't know was making eyes at me. Be an absolute darling and find out who he is. Okay, so how can I do that? Look him up in the passenger list. All I know are his initials. G Q C. The list's someplace. Find it. I'll wait right here. Ta! Okay. No worries. Alright, we can help her out, but first I want to try and get into that boiler room, so... I'm guessing we take the second class stairs. It's Georgia again. I knew you'd come. What happened? Charles received a telegram from the solicitors. Our estate's to be sold off. He asked about the necklace I gave you. I told him I left it with a purser. Don't say anything to him or Sasha. Not him and his group of... Oh, there's much more to tell you. Can you meet me in my stateroom? I'm in B7. It's Charles' custom to go for a drink in the smoking room. When he does, visit me. Okay. We can do that, Georgia. Alright, so we'll have to go check the smoking room and make sure Charles is occupied there. But first, I... See, really we need to be on the boat deck to go aft, don't we? Let's get, um, let's get back into the here we go, the staircase. Head up. Talk to this bloke later. Get out onto the boat deck. And now we'll head aft. Wait, that's forward. Never mind. Second class stairs. Now, this should be able to take us down to G deck, which is where the engine room and everything is. Class library, which unfortunately we can't go check out. E deck. Oh. Hello, sir. A fine night to be indoors. Cold as the Dickens outside. Cold as the Dickens. Cold but clear. Please. Excuse me. Clear as a bell, and the stars, oh, you should see a million stars in God's firmament. A congregation of light. Oh, they just got trapped. funded. The Reverend Edgar, I'm returning from a mission in Africa, to Sunapee, New Hampshire, where we'll... I mean, I live. Emily, my wife, she's dead. That's something to say to a complete stranger. My sympathies. Thank you. We had looked forward to this journey. But she died at Port Sahid, though it was Nyasaland that killed her. The doctors, you know, never did find all the parasites. Calling on Miss Pringle, she has been invaluable this voyage, a pillar. Oh yes, we're very glad she's with us. Unlike the occultist Trask, tempting the passengers with his What's occult that mysteries. Like? Sounds like an interesting fellow. Be wary of him. Trask's a trickster. Take this card, Trask the trickster. card, from my own collection. Thank you. Um, else? So you must like this section of the Titanic. Section? Here, second class. You can get to Scotland Road from here. Do you know it? Scotland Road? I do know it, but why not? What's Scotland Road? Scotland Road runs the length of the ship, from stern to bow on Eden. It allows the crew e to get from one side to the other quickly. I could go to third class if I take the Scotland Road, but I don't believe in social mixing. No, it, it creates too much anxiety. A place for everyone, and everyone a place. Though some don't choose to see it that way. Oh? In the course of my ministrations, I've observed a gentleman from first class. A young German, among the steerage women. Oh. Most, most unnatural. I haven't said anything. I wouldn't want to upset the ladies, especially Miss Pringle. She seems a fragile vessel. Oh, she's not. Um, how do I get the Scotland Road from here? Behind me, through those doors. Thank you. Good night. Wait, before you leave, I was wondering, perhaps you'd care to make a donation to our mission in Nyasaland? Oh, um, we talk about it later? I am very happy. Tomorrow we will discuss everything. Yeah, tomorrow. Good evening. Tomorrow. We'll, we'll talk about it tomorrow. Yeah. Yeah. Anyway, so the door's behind him. Scotland Road. Okay, so here we are. On road, so... Scotland Road 
aft, maybe? Engine room? We want to find the boiler room. I don't want to get caught down here. Boiler room should be around here somewhere. F deck, third class cabins. Go through the engine room to get there. Let's let's try. Locked. Okay. Second class stairs. Can't go any further that way. I just sworn the boiler rooms were down there. Unless this game has a different way of getting there. Have a look. E deck, F deck. forward. Let's try this stairwell. That just takes me to the Turkish bath. That's not going to take me anywhere. Oh, yeah, no passengers allowed on this deck. F deck cabins. These just take me down to the turbine room. Hello. Uh, I want to get caught down here, aren't I? Control room? Ah! What the? A passenger? I can't regulate the steam by boilers one and... So I don't have time for you. You're where you shouldn't be. Get up top before you're kicked up there. Perhaps I can help you out, buddy. Oh, I doubt it. She's really acting up. See? Still working the bugs out. See for yourself. Alright, I'll help you. Have at it. There's a gauge showing the turbines power. That was really the needle's got easy to convince you to let me zone. play Over with the here. engines. The needle's got to go into the green zone. Alright. Oh, yep. Yep. So interested? Go on, have a have a peek in the engine room. Oh. She's quite a sight. Oh, thanks, mate. Appreciate you. All in a day's work, you know. Engine room. Yeah, we've gotten past him. Oh, look at these engines. God oh, damn. How do I get to the boilers? Oop, oh, that's the smokestack. We don't want to climb the smokestack. Boilers, that's the Scotland Road. Where are the goddamn boilers? Third class cabins. I swear. Oh, damn it. I swear it's through here, though. See, we're in the wrong section. We need to be forward, so I'm not quite sure how this all works. I keep rushing past a door or something. First class reception. Turkish bath. Ah, okay, that's where this ends up. Class cabins. That's really it. Knock and run there. There's a ding dong ditch. Hmm. 
Well, look, since we can't find the boiler room at the moment, let's just go... Let's just go help out... Let's go help out, um... Miss Cashmore, shall we? Yes, can I help you? I require assistance, please. Perhaps. As purser, I'm in charge of the Titanic's passengers. Have you a name? If you do, I can tell you their cabin number. Yes, I... SB, Sasha Barbicorn. Of course. Oop, I went past it. I need a passenger with the initials GQC, please. Let me check. Aha, uh -huh. Mr. George Quincy Clifford, A27. A27. I live to serve. Thank you very much. Very good, then. Good night. Good night. Alright, let's go help. Miss Cashmore, hook up, shall we? She gonna hook up? She's at the aft grand staircase. Which is this way. I love B-deck on this game. A blue. Ah, Miss Cashmore. Did you get it? Get his name? I did. It's George Quincy Clifford. 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 Never heard of him. You don't suppose he's rich, do you? He could be filthy. You're an angel, and I've news for you, too. On a day's While work. While you were gone, Ooh. Andrew Conkling's been asking for you. Yes, Conkling, the steel bear. God knows what he's steel been bear. doing in Europe. Buying it, me. probably. Where was I? Oh, yes. Andrew Conkling asked me to pass along this. You know his wife, Beatrix, the designer? Such an eye! Her clothes preserve the bust line. Couldn't be more flattering. Keeps the eye moving. Much nicer than Worth's. Matter of extreme urgency requires your attention. Meet you me in Scotland Road. Right. They're mm. friends with Captain Smith. Smith! So handsome, so dashing. White Star's best officer. Or was. Mm. He's retiring after this voyage. Couldn't be more tragic. Oh, My you dear, have no you've idea. Launched. Bad news. Good night. Certainly, certainly, I must... It's Mrs. Borbank! Consuelo! Alright. So, we've learned where the Rubaiyat is. We've learned that Andrew Conkling wants to speak to us. And also, you know what? Let's go see, let's go see Georgia. Now, we're, at, we're right here at the smoking room, so let's see if Charles is in here. He is. Let's have a chat with him, shall we? Lord Lambeth. I'm travelling with my wife, Lady Lambeth. George has decided to take the air. I opted to take this. <laughs> Everything alright? My wife, Georgia, she's... she's unwell. Unwell? Sorry to hear that. Yes, it's uh, not the best situation, I'm afraid. And uh, just one of my troubles. Have other troubles? Too many to speak of. Where'd things go wrong? With Georgia, how else? Edge to me. Four years ago at a house party. She enchanted me. We got married and we're happy. But Georgia's moods grew volatile. She imagined plots against her everywhere. Even with Sasha. Sasha? Sasha cares more for money than for her. I know that now. Money to Sasha. <laughs> He's an art dealer. Money is everything to him. But Sasha has his secrets, and I know about them. That right. Sasha has his secrets, huh? Ever hear of the Black Hand? They're a secret band of Serbian nationalists. They're girls to fashion the greater Serbia out of various uh -huh. bits of the Balkans. Anyway, uh, Sasha's half Serbian. His gallery is their London meeting place, though. Uh, I rather doubt Sasha's too involved. Terrorism isn't profitable. Besides, the Tatler Society coverage rarely extends to Sarajevo. Where is he now? He's on board, actually, uh, shepherding a collection of paintings to New York. Aha! Uh -huh. But uh, that's a secret. Good night. And if you should uh, speak to my wife, remember, she tells some fairly tall tales. Is that right? 
Alright, well, let's go visit. Let's go visit Georgia now. It's B70, I believe her cabin was. Kevin. I wasn't sure you'd come. You always, you always are not sure if I'm coming when you've asked, literally asked me to meet you. Um, what's going on? First, I want to know how you fared these last years. Rather well, from the looks of you. I'm glad to see you. You're Thank the you. only person I can trust. Please promise me you'll help. Oh, excuse me. Sorry, Georgia. Yes, I promise to help you. You always were there when I needed you. I do my now, best, you know. Now, my life a horrible mess. All right. Tell me the story. When Charles discovered my affair with Sasha, he was quite calm. But I know him. His revenge is taking the necklace, leaving me with nothing. And so I'd never trust him again. Don't you see? They're looking for guns, for bombs. Who are they? Sasha's friends. His Black gallery hand. was their London base. Black hand. They were rough men. Foreign. Sasha told me they were part of a Balkan aid society. Stupid girl that I was, I believed him. But then I found out. These people, they... Charles! Well, this is awkward. Please, Georgia, continue. Was it my title or my income you found so desirable? I was never sure. Now that both assets are depleted, why don't you go to Sasha? Maybe he can help, as he's done before. Ignore him. I see the smoking rooms had its usual effect. This is awkward. Idle gossip, Kev. You see his attitude? Please, go. Since she obviously can't depend on me. Here, take the chill out of the air. Thank you for seeing after my wife. Now I think it best you leave the happy couple, drowning in their happiness. Good night. Remember, I need your help. Well, that was delightfully awkward. Okay, so what else do we need to do now? What time is it? It's after 10. Isn't that lovely? We don't have much time. Still need to get into that boiler room. Where, how the hell do we get there? You know what? This bloke, where is he? You, sir! Evening, I'm the lift attendant. And you'll not find one better at taking you where you want to go. Where to? Any directions, mate? <laughs> At your service. Uh, could you um <clears throat> tell me how to um the uh <clears throat> boiler rooms? The boiler rooms, blimey! Passengers ain't allowed down there. Take the second class stairs down to F deck. Yep. I fancy there's some stairs down from there. Now where to? Um. No worries, mate. That was fine. Very good, then. Cheers. Thanks for hum humoring my hypothetical directions. Uh, okay, let's go back to the second class stairs. I'm just going to go straight there. Now, he said F deck. Down to F deck. From B deck. B deck. B deck. F deck. You have to take cabins and this door, so I'm guessing it's through here. So the door's locked. Can't go that way. F34, that's Penny's cabin. Ah We've got some stairs. There's the turbine room. So it must be through here. Hang on, what about down here? This is the turbines. <laughs> Shouldn't play with that. Alright, um... There must be... It's gotta be through the engine room. We have to get there through the engine room. Has to be that. Hey, buddies. Just checking out the engine room again. You know me. Me and my machines. Um, so where did I go last time? Did I go up? Boiler room one. Two, and it's in three. Cold shoot four. 
You are a passenger. Excuse me, I would speak with you. Uh, what do you want, mate? Forgive me, I am sorry to intrude on you, a person of such high station. I am Vlad. What are your troubles? I have many. I am leaving my home. I am a serve and they have killed my wife, my children, the Austrian. For that, they will pay. But I do not want to burden you. Please, I need a fit. I have a friend in first class, in cabin A14. Mr. Babicon has a package for Asha. me. Can you bring it here? Why are you down here? I am a stowaway. If I am caught, maybe they throw me overboard. Please get the package. I've eaten nothing since we sailed. Save for a rat who is not so fast. His name is Barbican. In A14. Tell him you've come from Black. He will give you out the package. I wait here for your return. Your assistance will be repaid many fold. I'm gonna go ahead and save the game right here. Because I don't know if we're gonna be able to get the book past him if we go down here. Oh, the fucking cold guys are here. Ooh, what have we here? The fancy dress balls upstairs, mate. Ready? Check out the toff. Why's everyone shoveling? Why? It's the bridge. They want to go even fast. There's a shovel over there, but you don't look the type to sweat. All right. You've come to see her guts, have you? <laughs> yes. Uh Oh, you have bugger off up top with you now. <laughs> he looks like a looks like a member of Cold Chisel. Chief. Here we go. Take that. Now I don't know if we're gonna leave Wait. I have been looking for this. Thank you. Luckily I saved it. Alright, what we're going to do is we're going to go to A14. Oh, I know what to do. I know what to do. Add it and call shoot five. Yeah. He'll never be able to figure that out. Okay, let's, uh, let's go get rid of him now. Fast travel from here. A14. Oh, oh. Say, Jesus step. Christ. Have you heard, Henry? No harm done. No harm. I'm so sorry. Try by my toe. We're the Goss Joneses from Holt Whistle, you know. Oh. How are you finding the crossing? Lovely. Very nice. You're English then. I would have thought American. Close, Aussie. Oh my, my. I didn't mean to insult. Can't hold a thought. Dreadfully large place, I love America. These two. Brain like as if all that space and all those immigrants trying to fill it up. I was just commenting to Henry on a white star crossing. One meets all the right people. While we were just chatting with a delightful elderly couple in the reception, the Strausses own a small dry goods store in New York somewhere huh. called Macy's. On D Day. Right, now. <laughs> what was that look? I always finish my sentences. <laughs> You're as jumpy as that American chap, that photographer. Yes, he was just snapping away. Taking pictures of some German colonel and, and that Englishman. Snap, snap, snap. War's coming, all right. Mark my words. War? How beastly. Will Mr. Burns have to fight? He and his wife, such sweet things. But I do see her point. It is their honeymoon. Why he insists on snapping those photos, I haven't a clue. For God's sake, woman, talk, 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 like a madam in a Rangoon boardy house. Henry, that's unspeakable. Henry. So speak then. Henry. Yaps louder than a scrum of rabid corgis. Now see here, this Burns chap. If you want to see something interesting, take a look at his pictures. He's on sea deck. Cabin C, 78. Okay, I'll suss that out. Thank you. Um, where were we going? They've completely distracted me. Oh yeah, we're gonna go see Sasha. I wonder. Actually, let's just go see Sasha. A14, right? Other side. Okay. Yes? I'm looking for a Mr. Babakin. You found him. 
Sasha Barbican of Barbican Galleries. Nice to meet you, mate. Now, what is it that I can help you with? Um, for a package. Vlad. For Vlad? He's on board? Fucking voice. Please come in. <laughs> he did it. I told him not to, told him I'd pay his ticket, but he was too proud. Such a tragedy about his family. They were with my mother's people. What happened? When Austria took Bosnia, they were killed. Many were. With his family dead, America seems as good a place as any for Vlad. Ask Vlad, I don't know. Here, his things. He'll be glad to get them. It's rather late. Okay, good night. Good night. Enjoy your voyage. Shall. Got Vlad's package. Uh, this way. Let's go straight to the second class stairs. I like walking around, but I feel like we're nearing the end of this episode and I want to get a few things done. So let's uh, get down here. Where were those stairs? Aha, yeah, here we go. That's the second crew member that's, um, I've just realised. This bloke that's just sort of let me go into restricted areas because I'm such a nice bloke. Fled. Here's your package. I must see Mr. Barbicon. I have bad news. He will not be happy. I am oh. looking for something. Something very important. But it's not here. You have seen a small... It is of no importance. Good night. Good night. Alright, now that he's pissed off, let's go collect our book. Genius. Absolute genius. I love how they don't even say anything. Alright, let's go back to Penny's cabin now and speak to her. Did you get it? Did you find the Rubaiyat? Yes, I decoded a telegram Zadl sent. Smashing. What have you learned? Uh, the, he's exchanging the Rubaiyat for a painting that he'll pick up later. More art? Hmm. Zeitel's no connoisseur. No, there's something about that painting of interest to the German High Command. Mm-hmm. Well, I met a stowaway named Vlad. He knows Sasha, an art dealer. I don't have any information about Vlad, but the other fellow, look here. Zeitel's Tim. satanic contact is a London art dealer named Sasha Barbican. Interesting. They say he smuggles art, and he's not about selling stolen merchandise. The files say he's Serbian, interestingly enough, with links to some shady Balkan groups. Well, here's the Rubaiyat anyway. Let me see. That's the Rubaiyat, all right. Well done. Thank you. Leave it with the purser for safekeeping. It shall be undisturbed there. Okay, so what should I do now? The painting's what Zeitel's really after. You must secure it. Where or how, I don't care. Just find it and bring it back here. Remember, leave the Rubaiyat with the purser for safekeeping. He might also know where the painting's stored. Sneak a peek at his cargo manifest. That should help you find the painting. Cargo stored somewhere beneath the forecastle deck. Things are thickening up quite nicely, aren't they? They We've are. We've got to get our hands on that painting. Yep. Don't fail. I won't. Oof. Damn. Okay, hey, so we're like thirty something minutes in. Who cares? Let's um, let's keep playing. I want to keep playing. Uh, let's uh, head up to sea deck. And first things first, we're gonna stash the ribeye out with the purser. Actually, I don't think I can get anywhere from here. No. no. Uh, we need to head forward. Okay. Thea, 
Thayer. Thayer. Oh, uh, what do you want? Uh, Mr. Fail? Why, what do you know? Not that it matters. I'm much too busy. I must get this message through from Mr. Thayer. Mr. Thayer expects his private train car to meet him in New York, and I can't leave my post. But I need to send this telegram. Can I help? Help? Yes, it might be helpful if you delivered this message to the wireless room for me. Even better, why don't you send it for Mr. Thayer is a very important man. <laughs> How did... So send the telegram at once. And when you have, don't forget to tell me. How do you think I would be allowed to do that, mate? Um, well, I want to check something in while I'm here. Uh, Rubai out. Very nice. Security is our first priority. I'll put it in the safe. Thank you, sir. Good night. That's all, then. Is it? Good night. That would be the manifest there. Oh. Only I'm allowed to access the cargo manifest. What do you want? I just want to... Perhaps. As purser, I'm in charge of the Titanic's passengers. Certainly not. The manifest is the purser's. Only I look at the manifest. I right, live well. to serve. Okay. Oops. Very good, then. Good night. Good night, mate. Alright. Hmm. Actually, I think I'm going to leave that episode here, guys. Um, thanks for joining me. We've we've accomplished a lot, actually. We've got the Rubai out. We're on the trail of this painting that Zidal wants to get his hands on. You know, Sasha's involved with the Black Hand. Things are thickening up quite nicely. Next time, I want to go to the smoking room. See if Charles is there again, because I want to, I want to probe him a little bit more about what's going on between him and Georgia. But anyway, um, again... Thanks for watching. It is 10:39 p.m. on the night of April 14th, so we are definitely approaching the end. Let's hope we can get everything we need done within that time. But anyway, yeah, I'll catch you in the next one.